y'all hey welcome to my youtube channel and today i'm going to show you how to make this really cute diy fur boot first let's get into the materials now first you're going to need of course your boots some fur some freezer paper a needle and thread some scissors a sharpie and some tape now let's get into how to make the pattern now first you're going to start with your boots of course You're going to grab a piece of your freezer paper and you're going to fold it in half. You're going to cut some off because it's a little big for our boot. Then you're going to cut it halfway down on your fold. Wrap that around the shoe. Make sure the paper is flush to the sole. Grab your marker and you're going to outline the bottom of the shoe and midway on the shoe. It should look like this when you're done. Now you're going to take your paper off half and then cut out where you made your line. Now when you open up your pattern, it should fit on your shoe perfectly. Now what you're going to have to do when you're cutting out on your fabric is add a little extra to the front to round it off and add a little extra to the back for seam allowance. Now you're going to grab your tape with your pattern and attach it to your shoe. grab another piece of freezer paper and we're going to work on the top half of the pattern for the shoe. Now take your paper and fold it in half. Cut off some axis because of course the paper is too big. Take your paper and wrap it around your shoe. It's going to be a little big so you're going to cut off some of the axis.
Now let's get into how to cut it out on the fur. First, we're gonna start with the top half of the pattern. Now what we're going to do is, I'm parting it with my nail. This is very important if you don't want your fur to shed. Make sure you're cutting where you made your part. Also when you're cutting out, make sure you cut out a little bit of seam allowance for the top half of your boot and the back half of your boot. Now we're going to cut the bottom the same exact way we cut the top. Part the fur, cut on your part, and you're done. Now this part is optional. I attached the pattern to the fabric to make sure it didn't shift when I was parting and cutting it out. Now let's get into how to assemble your boot. Grab the bottom half of your pattern and your needle and thread. Now you're gonna begin sewing around the sole of the shoe and midway around the shoe.
when you get done, it should look something like this. bottom half and the top half together. Now you're going to take your needle and thread and you're going to take it through both pieces of fabric like so. my nails I took all the stones off and I was dyeing some hair purple and they turned purple now what I just showed you is a loop and pull method to make sure that it locks it in again here it is the loop over the needle and pull it back through. now we're going to take the top half of the fabric because you should have a little extra hanging over and go ahead and stuff that in there and sew around the edge of the book. And there you have it, your nice and fluffy fur boots. Thanks for watching you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on your notification bell so you'll be alerted every time I post a new video. Also, follow me on my social media. Let's be friends. Bye, guys.